Animate Ant-Man Shrinking with Animbot Tools. Test one, three, two, one. Whoa, 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 whoa. I told you this wasn't gonna work. <laughs> Speed controls are on the other hand. This is Keel Figgin's yellow dude rig for 30 USD. I changed the color to red to look more like Ant-Man. By the end of this video, you'll be animating Ant-Man shrinking without counter animating his sliding feet. You're going to start by select the legs, IK and pull vectors and the COG control. Go down to the Animbot toolbar and click the temp control button. Create a simple control in world space and select a color. To change the colors of your temp controls, go down to the Animbot toolbar, select the arrow above the temp control icon and go to the temp control panel. Click on the color to change it. Now when you scale down the amount, the feet don't slide and the COG stays where it is. It's okay that the legs stretch because the COG will be animated down. Once you scale down your character, his feet will float. To fix this, we'll need to change the pivot point in the scale space. Select the blue feet pinner controls. In the channel box, turn on manual pivot control. This rig does not have a gimbal control, but this control right here will do the trick. To help visualize where we're placing the new pivot, go to create locator. Now select the original IK leg, go down to the Anabot toolbar, and click the copy X forms world space button. Then select your locator, go to the Anabot toolbar, and click the arrow above copy X forms world space, and click paste X forms world space. Select the IK ball manual control and move it up until the locator is at the ball of the foot. Rotate the toe up. If your feet scaled underneath you, you have two choices to shift your weight over your heels or your toes. And I think the smarter decision is to shift over your toes. So place the new pivot under the ball of his foot. Where the locator is, is where your new pivot will be. Select all of your character controls. Go down to your Anabot toolbar and click snapshot mirror settings. Select his IK ball manual control and click the mirror pose button. Now when you place your new temp controls on the ground and reduce the scale amount, his feet don't slide. In this scene, the root control is pointing at the camera, but the temp controls are in world space. To get them in the same space as the root control without inheriting the scale value, select the root control, go down to the Anabot toolbar, and click Copy X Forms World Space. Rename your locator Temp Control Space. Select the locator, go to your Anabot toolbar, click on the arrow above the Copy X Forms World Space icon, and click Paste X Forms World Space. One at a time, select your temp control and shift select your locator. Then go down to the Anabot toolbar, hold down control on your keyboard and click the temp control relative space icon. Repeat this process for the rest of your temp controls. Now you can turn off the visibility of your locator. Now your temp controls are in the same orientation as your root control, but still not affected by the scale amount. Use coupon code TWIGAARTS for $10 off of the ECO and PRO versions of Animbot. Please consider becoming a patron. Thank you to my first patron. Or subscribe, because it's free, just like this video. Leave a comment if something doesn't work and I'll respond with a solution.